Hi everyone. The topic of today's video is public student colleague. Student colleague is required for students whose school leaving certificate is con not considered equivalent with the German school leaving certificate. Therefore, they have to attend one year of foundation course or student colleague in order to make your school leaving certificate equivalent with the German school leaving certificate. And then you will be able to apply for bachelor degree in Germany. There are two types of student colleague, public and private. Uh, in this video, we will discuss only the public student colleague. So let's start. Now, public student colleague is associated with public university. Uh, there is usually one student colleague located in one particular state and all the universities located in that particular state are associated with this student colleague. There are some states where there are multiple student colleagues and there is one state in Nordra in Westphalia where there is no public student colleague and none of the university is offering any student colleague for the international students. Now I, I have made a second slide in which I will show you how the application process for student colleague works. Um, there we can check how to apply for the student colleague in a, uh, if you want to apply for a public one. Now, public student colleague is conducted in German language. Um, it means that all the subjects that you will be studying during the public student colleague, they will be in German language, which um, the subjects will differ uh, depending on what bachelor degree you are interested in and what bachelor degree you would like to study. Uh, I have made a detailed video on this. You can check what that video to know which subjects uh, you will study when you want to study uh, engineering or medicine or business, etc. Now, in order to apply for stu public student colleagues, you must have learned at least B1 or in some cases, even B2 level of German language which means that you have to have this level of German language uh, acquired already at the time of application. Uh, so you first learn German language until B1 or B2 level, depending on the requirement, and only then you can apply for the student colleague. Uh, there are, however, uh, some exceptions in this case also, like TU Klausthal, which does not require any minimum level of German language, you can apply for TU Klausthal student colleague even with, um, uh, without having any German language certificate. Now, one important point is that public student colleague has an entrance exam. Now, it is important uh, because uh, it can be the case that um, uh, 500 students have appeared in the entrance exam of a student colleague and only 50 have passed the exam, let's say. And out of 50, the university has only 30 seats to accommodate the students. Now, if even though the uh, 50 students have passed the entrance exam, only the 30 top ranked students will be admitted to the entrance exam and the remaining 20 they have to appear for entrance exam at some other student colleague or they have to appear for the entrance exam uh, in the next um, term. The second important challenge uh, for public student colleague is that although you have passed the um, B1 or B2 level of German language, the entrance exam will also have uh, additional subject like mathematics if, if you want to study engineering later on. Um, and if you do not know the terms of mathematics in German language, you will not be able to solve the ex uh, exam. So you will um, definitely not be able to qualify. So you have to put extra effort apart from B1 or B2 level of German language in order to score really very well in the entrance exam of public student colleague. Now, student colleague duration is one year, which consists of two semesters. Uh, there is one break in between. Uh, uh, after the first semester, there is one break. And after the second semester, there is a final exam, which is called Feststellungsprüfung. 
um, there are two intakes you can apply for either summer semester or the winter semester uh, depending on your ease um, uh, the next point is public student colleague has no tuition fee now this is true for all states except uh, Baden Wurttemberg, uh, where you have to pay 1,500 euros for one semester, which means one year uh, student colleague will cost you 3,000 euros for uh, the tuition fees only. Uh, then uh, the next point is possibility to get university accommodation and semester ticket. That is very important uh, because if you uh, get university accommodation, uh, it will save a lot of money for you. Uh, uh, let's say the university accommodation, uh, uh, you have to pay around 200 to 300 euros per month. Uh, whereas if you get a private accommodation first, it's very hard to find outside um, because all the landlord, they will be asking for some kind of uh, security in terms of uh, some evidence that you are also earning so that you are able to pay the rent. Uh, remember, they will not uh, check your bank account statements, etc. So it's very difficult uh, to for students to get private accommodation uh, outside of university. Therefore, you have very big advantage. Uh, all your utility bills are included in the hostel uh, uh, rent that you pay. Therefore, it's very much um, economical for students and the second thing you will get is the semester ticket you will uh, once you are enrolled at a public student college you are considered as a student and you are uh, able to get semester ticket which allows you to uh, use the public transport uh, of all kind um, through that semester ticket so this uh, semester ticket is valid for one semester, which means six months. Uh, you pay some um, amount for it, but that is like uh, one by third or one by fourth of the amount that you have to pay if you do not have this facility. Um, so uh, the amount you have to pay for traveling, uh, if you are not enrolled at a public student colleague is almost three to four times uh, higher. Uh, and that is a, um, like a very big amount. Uh, students have to apply to the university, not to the student colleague. Um, this I will show you in the next slide how uh, you should understand this requirement. Now you on, are on the left hand side, an applicant, and you have uh, figured out that your school leaving certificate is not equivalent with the German school leaving certificate and you are required to attend a student colleague. Now, you also know that you cannot apply to the student colleague directly. Therefore, you have checked the website of three different universities and you have selected three different courses to which you want to apply. Now, let's say that uh, the two um, universities, university one and two, they are situated in the same state. They are sta uh, situated in state one. And the third university is located in a state two of Germany. And uh, we have, um, uh, to make it clear for you, I have uh, taken two scenarios. Uh, so first start, we, we start with a simple scenario of state two, where the university number three is located. So you have to uh, apply to university number three for a bachelor degree program, although you know that you will not get admission into bachelor degree uh, and you need to study student colleague. And this university accepts the stu applica applications directly. Therefore, you send all your uh, academic documents as well as B1 or B2 level of German language certificate to this particular university, they will evaluate your application documents and they will forward your application document to the student colleague. They will, and student colleague B will invite you for the entrance exam uh, of student colleague. Now, the university one and two, uh, which are located in state one of Germany, they, uh, when you read the 
their requirement and the application process for international student you come to know that yeah, they do not accept the applications directly from applicant rather they ask the applicants to apply for the interested uh, for the course they are interested in through uni assist now you have to go to the portal of uni assist uh, create your account i have made one video also regard how you can create an account how can, you can apply for student colleague you can refer to that video so you go to that portal of uni assist register yourself select the course apply for the course pay, make the payment and then your the uni assist will evaluate your application and they will send to the university or they can also send it directly to the student colleague depending on the university so the and in the end student colleague a for university one and two will get in contact with you and they will uh, invite you um, for the um, uh, entrance exam if you fulfill all the requirements if you have sent all the required documents so i hope this uh, video clarifies all your doubts regarding the public student colleague if you still have any doubts uh, you can write your um, question in the comment section and um, if you like the video share it with your friends and subscribe to the channel so that you can get more um, content regarding your application process visa process and um, so that you can make it easier for you thank you for watching the video bye